Hey yo, welcome back everybody to Boo. The man, the myth, when that's the wrong, why do I always say that? The ranger, the guy with the guns. So during two live streams, I did two live streams. It should be one yesterday and then the one before that. Uh, if this is posted on Friday, which I'm assuming it'll be. Uh, I did those two live streams and I got my hands on a bunch of weapons, a bunch of armor upgrades, a bunch of stuff you see. We have the Xerox armor set. We have the two slots and then some new accessories this is new so look at this your global damage modifier is applied to your defense while in the ethereal and then we have this which allows us to use ethereal accessories outside of the ethereal now if you look at our defense <laughs> it's at a nice 197 we take that off it's at 132 we're probably getting buffed by something else honestly but yeah this is a pretty good accessory if you couldn't tell also have a bunch of weapons here, Onyx Blaster, Astral Defeat, Scorpio, Element Blast, Elemental Blaster, Elemental Eruption. We all know the Fungal Spirit and the Disseminator. Dis Disseminator, whatever. If you guys know any other weapons I'm able to craft right now, leave a comment. Tell me. But yeah, let's go ahead. Let's take on our first set of Post Moon Lord bosses. I don't know why I like pause there saying Post Moon Lord bosses. We're going to start with one that I did fight on stream. And we're going to fight it right now. It's not even in there. It's in the piggy bank. It is the boom. Jumbo Cactuar. The man, the myth, the cactus. Okay, we'll throw that away since we already have that set up. But yeah, let's go ahead. Let's go over here to the jungle. And let's, let's start this fight. This fight shouldn't be too bad because I did fight him on the stream. It wasn't that tough. We don't even have this arena. is isn't even a good arena either. But it's all good. We don't need no good arena to fight a boss. Come on. Good arena. Oh, but I need a good arena. I do not feel like I'm zoomed out. Okay. I know I wasn't zoomed out. Let's use the fungal sphere. The fungal sphere might be good. I can't tell. You can oh, God. Oh, we got to hit some good. These things. these things will one-shot me. These hollow cactuses. They do a lot of damage. So let's get rid of them. Use this bow. Use the Astral Defeat. I don't. I remember the uh, Void Bow from Fargo's mod, but they took it out, sadly. From what I know, they took it out. Well, I'm dead. Woo! Barely made it out alive. We're gonna, we're gonna go for it. Woo! That was a close fight. That was a lot closer than it should have been. The shitty arena doesn't help in, at all, but you know. You gotta, you gotta use what you gotta use, you know? I didn't have anything at my disposal that was good enough. I did, I have a whole arena set up, but it's not in the desert. And I don't know how that boss works when it comes to fighting it outside of its home biome. But, uh, boom. 20 platinum for selling this mask? I don't know if that's a bug or what. But yeah, I already have all the stuff that he drops. Uh, and when I say stuff, I mean like the, the music box and the trophy and the mask, whatever. Actually, I don't know if I have those. I don't know if I have the trophy or the mask. But I have something, because I fought him. Like I said, I fought him on the stream. But now we have this, the cactus token, which creates the jumbo, the jumbo. Let's make it real quick. And we could also make the infected arm cannon while we're at it. Damn, and it's got deadly on it. Destined that I use it. I've been getting this thing that pops up all the time recently. I have no idea what it is. <laughs> no idea at all. All right, meteorite bars. So we need some meteorite bars. Let's see here. I don't have any meteorite apparently it's all good didn't expect to fight that boss so this is like a dark red color i have no idea no idea how good this is but uh i guess we're gonna find out with whatever boss we fight i don't know what rep weapon to replace I guess a scorpio on if i'm being honest if i'm being honest scorpio is not the greatest weapon but uh you know what uh, what do i know what do i know we'll put it at the end it's actually not bad. It does heavy damage, but it's just really slow. And I feel like post moon lord bosses are not post moon lord. Post moon lord weapons should all be really fast. So let me test this bow out on some boss. I don't know. The metallic eye. Why not? Why did I do that? I need to set up a bed in my mushroom biome. Set it up like right here or something. Because I have this new teleporter. Boom. Brings us straight to the arena. It's the greatest invention I've made. Oh my god, it does good damage, don't get me wrong. But we are fighting mech bosses. These are not, you know, the post Moon Lord bosses that we're going to be fighting very soon. Or fighting the rest of the series, is what I should say. 
But yeah, not bad. We'll hold on to it. Um, let's go ahead. Let's take on the next boss then. Because if you haven't noticed, I try to do. Oh, we gotta make it. I try to do at least two bosses. Not two. Three bosses, and then if not three, two. And uh, you know, like an episode ago when we went to the ethereal, we did a lot of bosses. <laughs> we did like every single boss. Every single boss we fought in the past, vanilla and uh, Enigma mod bosses. I think I missed a couple still, like Duke Fishron, I, I still missed them. Whatever, it don't matter. Let's move on here. We have Vulcanox and Profane Guardians. Then there's Abaddon, Providence. Okay, so we got a good amount of bosses here. Let's see here. Void Leviathan uses, uses at, use a beacon of Ethereal Abyss at nighttime. Hmm, I think maybe, I think Profane, Profane Guardians are probably going to be the easiest ones to take on. The only thing is, I don't know if I have an arena for it or not. Profane Shard. Okay, we can make this. We can make this no problem. Uh, in the hollow, it says in the hollow. I mean, we have this arena, but <laughs> this arena is kind of full. Maybe we go to this desert over here and turn it into a hollow. I think that's what I'm going to do. All right. So I'm going to be right back. I'm going to make an arena over here. Turn it into a hollow so it's easier to fight Providence. And I will be right back. All right. The arena is very basic. Very simple. But uh, hopefully it works out. I have no idea. We'll see. This Providence or the Profane Guardians. This shouldn't be too hard of a fight from what I know. But uh, let's see. Let's try out this bone. Maybe this will help. Ooh. Love. We chunking them. We chunking them. Honestly, we should be like an unmovable force. <laughs> we have so much defense. Look how much defense. We have 230 defense. Like, I don't even know if you get that high normally when it comes to defense. Like, what's the best armor set? Does that even give you that much? I don't know, but look, you can never say I never used the jumbo. Good play on words there from Juice. The jumbo has been used. Don't we have Laudanum? I think we have Laudanum already. But there you go. There is the Profane Guardian's dead. I don't think I'm going to fight Providence this episode. Don't really want to because it's a little bit of a tougher fight. And I probably want to make a better arena. Let me check if I have Laudanum already. I do have Laudanum already. Now, there's like a super accessory you can make. Dradon's Heart. We, we can make this, right? <laughs> we might be able to make that, honestly. Uh, let me see. Now we're very close. We're just missing stress pills. Which I don't even know what that drops from. But okay, okay. I don't know if that's really a good thing or not. Slime Rancher picture. Look at this. Who wants this in their room? Right here. Shout out Slime Rancher. I don't know if that's a good game or not. A lot of people play it. I'm assuming it is. But uh, personally, I have not played it yet. But yeah, moving on. Next boss. Let's take on a new boss, baby. Vulcanox. Charred Core. So use it in the underworld. I don't think I have an arena in the underworld either. But, uh, you know, we'll, we'll try our best. Uh-oh, am I missing something? I don't know what that says. Nebulon fragment, I think. <laughs> something fragment. Neutron fragment. I don't know why I just said fragment. Um, What am I making? Charred core. That wasn't enough? Oh, it was 10. Okay. Got it. No problem. This is like Galactica Singularity, but like a little bit lesser. Because it only uses one, I think, instead of five fragments. But now we should be able to make it. I have no idea if this boss is hard or not. What am I? Oh, I'm missing Pyroplasm. Okay. So let me tell you how we get Pyroplasm. You ready? You go to the dungeon. You kill enemies. That's how you get Pyroplasm. So I'll be right back. All right. So let's go ahead. Let's make. That's not what it's called. Let's go ahead. Let's craft this thing. Boom. Charred core activate. Let's do it. I, I think I have a decent enough arena down here. Like this is decent. It's nothing really special though is the problem. So there's just like a box. There's no healing. There's none of that. Well, there might be a campfire. I'm not 100% I'm not sure. Let me check right now. Anything? Anything here at all? Not here campfires. All right. No problem. No problem. Let's do it. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm almost dead already. Um, I'm going to 
it's a defensive mode already, and I'm gonna use this. I hope you guys can hear me, because I can't hear myself, if I'm being honest here. <laughs> we have an enemy entering the ring. How kind of him. Enter the ring. Let's see. Oh my god, this is like a Plantera type boss. I like this. I like this a lot. Woo! Phew! We activated our rage. Oh, this should be a dub. This should be a dub. Oh my god. Okay, that was... I like that fight. That was pretty tough. That wasn't something easy. That first hit he hit me with and like knocked me. The what? The what, Leviathan? The who? <laughs> so I'm sitting here waiting for this void Levi Leviathan to spawn. I've been hearing weird noises, but I haven't seen anything yet. I heard like a laser noise play for a second. I don't, I don't know what's going on. <laughs> is it not actually, is it a bug maybe? It might be a bug. You hear these noises? Like what are these noises? These aren't enemies from down here. <laughs> I don't know. I don't see nothing. Alright. <laughs> I guess don't worry about it. But yeah, let's see what's in the treasure bag. Go ahead, let me sell this, this, this. Pick that up. Look. These ghouls are spawning out of nowhere. Is what I noticed. Maybe that has something to do with the Void Leviathan? I don't I'm not sure. I still haven't seen anything though. But yeah, let's see what's in the treasure bag. So we got a heart thing or a mana magic what's it called? Mage thing. <laughs> and then we got Pip Boy. <gasps> I'm a Fallout fan. I like that. Good job, Alchemist NPC. Ignites nearby enemies, 10% increased damage. It's not bad. It's really not bad. Really not bad. 10% increased damage. I might have to. It might be time to say goodbye to the magic quiver. I don't really think you know the speed of arrows is really affected for these late game arrows. They shoot really fast, but I, I think it's time to say goodbye to an old friend. But what is this? Look at this. This is a material. Shows most of the player's stats while in your inventory. Huh. That's cool. Was it combining to Pit Boy 4K? Left click to teleport home. Whoa. This is pretty cool. I like this a lot. Okay, I see you. I don't know what gun to get rid of. Honestly, look, there's these ghouls that just keep on spawning. I don't know what's going on there. Um, the elemental eruption is okay, but literally the fungalosphere does 200 more damage in it. So we'll do that. But yeah, let me go here real quick. We're going to open this up. Get a token. Good old warding token. Boom. And then we're going to reforge this. But, uh, what does this quiver do? Look, see, what are these enemies that keep spawning? Something is, something is on me. I don't know what it is. Something is trying to kill me. Okay, so that's used for the, uh, the upgrade to this. The sniper's essence. So let's toss that in there. We'll make that eventually on a stream episode. And, uh, let's reforge this. Where's the goblin at? There he is. Go ahead, reforge this, my guy. Boom. Get mad. Give me that. So, uh, yeah, we're going to end this episode off here. I have no idea what this Void Leviathan stuff is. Hopefully the mod dev will comment or something and tell me. Yeah, I will see y'all next time. Hey, yo, what's up, everyone? So, I do have a Twitch where I live stream a bunch of content. I do a lot of viewer games. I stream a lot of Terraria. And obviously, the stream series, they start on Twitch and then they eventually end up YouTube. So, make sure to check that out. Link will be in description. It will also be right here on the screen. Uh, and I also have a Twitter and a Discord. Check the description. Those are usually at the bottom of the description. Twitter and Discord is where I notify people that I'm streaming. And I also give, you know, updates or stuff like when mod reviews are going to come out. Or, you know, why there's no video today or something like that. But yeah. Thank you guys for watching. Peace out. Pee pee out.